Please stand for the pledge. I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Hey Wasatch, my name is Jameson Pace and I'm your secretary historian. And my name is Asher Price and I'm your public relations officer. Uh, hey guys, please check the lost and found table outside the office. These items will be taken away at the end of the month. You don't want to lose these fancy pair of dress shoes. They might be my size. This announcement is for the 8th graders who are going to Skyline who want to play soccer. The Skyline Women's Soccer Orientation Meeting for the 2022 season will be held on Tuesday, April 19th, 8 p.m. to 9 p.m. in the Skyline Cafeteria, a modular building on the south side of campus. Any junior high players and families who are attending Skyline in the fall of 2022 and interested in playing women's soccer are invited to attend. Attention Wasatch Warriors, it's spring and you know what that means, it's time for track and field. What's track and field you ask? Why it's a sport that includes running sprints, distances, jumping competitions, and even throwing events, and we'd love to see you on the team. Track and field starts this week and practices will be after school on the North Field every Monday through Thursday after school. You just need to make sure you can attend and make two to three practices per week to stay on the team and compete to show the other junior highs in Granite who's the best at throwing javelin, running 800 meters, and jumping the highest. The coaches this year are Mr. Alvarado, Mr. Peterson, and Ms. Walker. We hope to see you and go Warriors. Attention seventh graders, your Wasatch seventh grade team is pleased to announce the return of our annual seventh grade field trip on Tuesday, April 19th. This year, we'll be headed to This Is A Place Historic Monument, and we're excited to see you all there. Your math teachers handed out permission slips that must be signed in order for you to come to the field trip. The field trip will be from 9.30 a.m. that day until 1 p.m. The last day to get your permission slip in is this Friday, April 15th. Also, we're looking for parent volunteers to help chaperone the event, and their ticket will be covered. If your parents or guardians are interested in coming with us that day, be sure they fill out the form in the back. Again, we're so excited to be able to go and do these field trips again, and we are looking forward to seeing you all there. Congratulations to the wrestling team for a successful season. Wrestlers, there will be a team party this Thursday at 3 p.m. in Mr. Crookston's room. There will be some food and some awards given. Wrestlers, please invite your parents. Also, if you have any wrestling gear that needs to be returned, please turn them in ASAP or it will be charged to your account. See you Thursday after school. Quidditch is coming. Come learn to how to play this magical sport today at 3 p.m. in room 217. This is an intramural sport. Everyone is welcome. We will begin by learning the rules and playing scrimmages and then form teams to compete in a tournament of houses. Practices will be on Tuesdays and Thursdays from 3 to 4, starting Tuesday, April 19th. Here's a cool video to get you excited. Have you ever wanted to learn the greatest sport ever? Come learn Quidditch with me, Miss Thompson, um, the week after spring break. We will be having intramural Quidditch starting after spring break, so come to an informational meeting on Tuesday the 12th or Wednesday the 13th to get a permission slip and learn the, world, the rules of Quidditch. See you there. We're giving you a heads up. Permission slips for the movie and the Classic Fun Center will be in the office on Friday the 15th. There will be lists on the office window indic indicating who can go to the movie and who can go to Classic Fun Center. The deadline for returning both of these permission slips back in the office is May 9th. Here's an announcement from the Counseling Center. Students who are interested in competing in completing an online class over the summer need to see the counselor for the registration form. Taking online high school classes during the summer can free up some room in your high school schedule. They also offer a limited number of junior high courses. Registration starts next week, so be sure to see your counselor this week if taking an online class over the summer is the right fit for you. 
And now for a College of the Month video. The fundamental mission of the Juilliard School is to educate and train the next generation of actors, dancers, and musicians. Through apps and developing curricula for the K through 12 system, the Juilliard School is bringing forth ideas about how the arts can affect society in a global environment. Thanks for being here. Have a Quidditch Wednesday, Wasatch.